Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. This is the reading for the sign of Scorpio for the week of 5th to 11th of September 2022. Keep in mind, this is a general reading. So you may or may not resonate with this reading. If you do not resonate, please do not try to deliberately fit in. Check in your any other placements and moon rising or Venus. Also, if you want to book a personal reading, the link is in the description below. You can also follow me on Instagram. The link is in the description below. Let's get started with the reading. What are the current energies for Scorpio? And if you're new to my channel, please do not forget to hit the subscribe button. What are the current energies for Scorpio? Oh, Eight of Cups. Why detached? Emotionally detached from the world? Or what? From yourself? Let's find out. Yo, wow, wow, wow. Okay. I see. You no longer uh, find yourself emotionally stuck somewhere. Like, uh, earlier you were like, you know, emotionally, you on emotional front, you found yourself, you know, unable to find a solution to uh, unable to find a way out from a situation you were like so much emotionally involved somewhere you're still stuck but you have put your emotions out of it now so you're in a better place now all right it's a good thing what else six of cups there could possibly be a child reunion uh, it's not a college reunion i will say this reunion is from a very younger person not younger person like you have known this person uh, from your childhood i will say there is going to be a reunion this week for you all right what else Okay, two of swords is here. What else? Oh. You have received some news and you're not telling anyone what is it about. You might be receiving a call, might be receiving a message. There is some sort of news coming your way. Uh, you are not telling about it to anyone. That, you know, I have received some news regarding something. You're not telling anyone about it all right let's see what is happening in the love life wow it was fast the star is here with the knight of wands you know you want the healing my hook or by crook you think you are going in a right way right path you don't know what you're doing you just want to get over some things in you know in hurry you you definitely are in no mood to wait around you want to get over some things some person some bad habits in a relationship some whatever you know you're dealing with you want to run away from that situation as fast as possible and run away i will say heal from it like whatever happened happened you just want to forget about it want to do things that makes you forget about it all right let's see what happened in the past for you oh two cards came king of wands is here with two of wands one more card with ten of cups this is what has happened in the past <laughs> your person was not agreeing to what you were saying whenever you brought a family thing up like when we will be together in the future they will leave you hanging they won't respond to those uh, texts or conversations seriously uh, they will give a vibe of uh, i'm not so sure where this is going 
that's what you know their vibes will tell you like they are still in a phase of thinking about what to do with this relationship that's the vibe they are giving but it's a very genuine feeling from their side we should not blame them uh they are also very cautious about you it's not like they are playing games with you or anything else uh they just want to make the right decision for themselves too and they want to think about it as the one has the right to do so all right so let's see what are their intentions towards you Is here. All right. What else? One card is here. The death is here. Could be dealing with another Scorpio. Could be dealing with Aries, Leo, or Sagittarius. It's very prominent in this reading. Uh, there is some sort of clarity coming your way. The burden that you have been carrying around with you all the time is ended. and they are coming with this towards you you know it's not like on your own you feel like uh, the burden is coming down they will help you i believe they will come and clear things out with you all right let's find out what are the blockages here what are the blockages in this relationship oh ten of swords with two of cups five of swords their intentions are like this only like you know what i was telling here about getting the burden removed it's the blockage here that it is not getting removed i believe that their intentions are they are not showing any actions regarding it and that's why it's coming as a blockage because i see when their actions are coming in or when they think that they should be taking some some actions towards this this intention there is then there comes the five of swords in the you know uh, line that there will be some arguments i believe they want to they want to you know delay the argument or delay the process to minimize the arguments all right let's find out what is coming in the future for scorpio is here with queen of swords what else the wheel of fortune nice what else with the sun okay uh future is quite good emotionally you will be very much happy uh this person will bring some sort of you know clarity that you have been waiting waiting around for this blockage is definitely going to get removed with the wheel of fortune and the sun two major arcana cards coming in your way in the future it's a very good sign that is uh, your clarity whatever the burdens were they were their intentions are coming in their actions and don't worry about it with the wheel and the sun with the queen of swords and nine of cups this combination is a very good situation coming in your path everything will be sorted you will be like oh you meant this when you said this this is going to happen in the future that's what is coming don't worry everything will be all right with wheel and the sun you will find the clarity and the burden all the burdens will be removed with the actions of your partner in the relationship all right let's find out what are the messages from the universe for you let's find out what are the messages from the universe for you Okay, two cards came. What's your honest truth? And one step ahead is all you need. One more card. Prosperity, sisters, our happiness and joy. Be happy. 
don't crib and cry learn whatever is coming your way what's your honest truth what do you know what you actually want ask yourself don't lie to yourself and one step whatever you fear take one step and you will be one step closer to your achievement that's all the universe is saying to you all right that's it for the reading thank you